Never gets old, does it? <laughs> UCLA gymnast Caitlin Ohashi scoring that perfect 10 for her floral routine earlier this month, and it became an internet sensation. And who can forget the flawless routine, really? The crowd just went wild, and so did the judges. That's right. Well, Jeff, we caught up with the sensational gymnast who opened up about her hard work and how she once gave up the sport she loved so much. UCLA's Polly Pavilion, Pat. More than 10,000 fans there to watch the women's gymnastics team take on Arizona State. The crowd, 50% bigger than average. Maybe something to do with Caitlin Ohashi's video that took the internet by storm. It's been insane. <laughs> Though new to being an overnight sensation. I've been doing it for a really long time. It just so happens that people have just overnight started to realize it. Caitlin started gymnastics when she was just three years old. In the years that followed, I made national team when I was 12 years old. Despite her extraordinary success, by the time she was old enough to compete in the Olympics, Caitlin no longer wanted to be a gymnastics great. Because when I had been great, I had lost so much joy and so much of myself in the process that I just, I associated greatness with misery. Like many elite gymnasts. I went through a lot of body shaming throughout my entire gymnastics career starting when I was probably 14 years old. So it's something you realize you can't escape when one, you have a platform, you have people looking at you, and then you have, you know, family members and coaches that are really strict on your weight. As her self-image plummeted, Caitlin left the sport she once loved. It was UCLA gymnastics coach Val Condos who gently coaxed her onto the team and back into action. Coming back was extremely hard, but like I think every second has been worth it and I think everything that I went through has only set me up for what I've been able to achieve and like the type of joy that I've gotten from it now. I'm so happy that I've stayed in it long enough to get on this side of it. And we're glad she came back too, so we can see her. Such a remarkable young lady and a talented gymnast.